You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. August 4th, the Pike County Board of Education called a special meeting to decide on delaying the start of school in the aftermath of flooding across the county. The board approved moving the start date of the school year from August 11th to August 18th. We were up in Hollis yesterday and I, to, in my opinion they wasn't ready for buses to go up them Hollis and everything. And, uh, and, and What's on people's mind now is getting through this instead of getting the kids back to school, to be honest with you. That's the last thing on their mind. Yeah, like Mr. Blankenship said, we assessed some bus routes yesterday. Uh, several areas are still uh, impassable. Uh, a lot of bridges washed out in both our districts. Uh, so it would be really hard at this time to get kids to school. So. While no schools were damaged in the flooding, many residents lost their homes and personal belongings. Shelby Valley Elementary is also unable to prepare for the school year as it is currently operating as a distribution hub and housing over 80 displaced residents. And I think after, uh, I think we're going to have to look at uh, transitioning uh, uh, out of the school and everything because they're going to have to uh, get the school ready for the kids. That, that's going to be a priority in the next, next few days is uh, transitioning from uh, maybe go to other centers uh, with it and everything. The board will reassess the matter before the start of the school year to see if further delay is necessary. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.